Good day, fish finders for fishing poles. I'm on silent and we're on the air with more Monkey Island to the Chuck's Revenge. This time out we are going we are we are going fishing. Because if we're going to retrieve the second map piece, we need to find a fish in order to uh well, I guess in order to win the fishing pole, in order to retrieve the map piece that's hanging off the side of a cliff on Booty Island. And I thought, oh, well, let's go to the Vichy Swaz Effect Karat Hairs. I've never been much for rodent seasonings. Well, it's worth a shot. All right, anything in here? I hate fruit cocktail. I guess not. All right. The barkeep might see me. Okay, back out the, back out the window then. Well, we, I was looking for fish, so that way we could... We're in the middle of a bet with a fisherman on on the was Fat Island, wasn't it? Yes. If I could catch a bigger fish than him, then I can get the what you who's it? I can get the monkey playing piano. Okay, and that's a thing. We can get uh, we can get his fishing pole to retrieve the map piece, but uh, we're kind of stuck at the moment without any fish, unless you've got some. Excuse me. Yeah, boy? No, well, never mind. Nice place you have here. Well, see ya. Well, it was worth a shot. Maybe there's a way for you to pick up the monkey in here. Well, that's quite obvious. We've got a banana somewhere, right? Hey, don't bug the monkey. Okay. It's a metronome. Yes, it is. I wonder. If we can't give the monkey, the banana to the monkey directly. What if we distract it with the metronome? There. Hey, what'd you do to my piano player? I seem to have hypnotized your piano player. No, I've, I've actually. <laughs> what the? Take my <laughs> Thanks for nothing, buddy. Okay. <laughs> Okay. Well, I mean, we, we, we've got a monkey. Don't know what the hell I'm going to do with it, but I've got a monkey. Now we just need to get ourselves a fish. If you were a fish, where would you be? That's the question, right? I know where. Wait, wait, wait. Back up. Bet you there's a fish that's part of Largo's Leftovers. Ah, there you go. Meanwhile, the uh, innkeeper has run off. How long has he been chasing his uh, little ankle? Oh, no, there isn't. Never mind. Well, it was worth a shot, right? They look pretty old. Hmm. All right. That didn't work as well. None of this has worked quite as well as I'd hoped. Where else would there be a fish if I was looking for it? There could still be one on Booty Island. Because I seem to recall that there was a fish on the on the table. Now well, there's I have to go back out to this to go back out to the street to, to, I'm trying to see if there's a shortcut over to Dread Ship, but apparently not. Because it's a ship there, right? But the entire place is just a series of, uh, there we go, back to the path. A series of assembled chips. Where do you want to go? No, it's night there, everywhere except on board Captain Dredd's ship. All right, back to Butcher Island. I have an idea. There's no other way, oh, there's a way out to the path here. I don't have to go through the spitting contest again. Can we go back to the mansion? I have an idea. I'm hoping. There we go. On inside. Hello, woofer. Dang. Can we pick up the bones? You're the one about the polar bear with the hair lip. Too late. They're already picked clean. To the salmon pate. Pate! Well. Too late. They're already picked clean. That didn't go as well as I'd hoped. 
Is there anything? We can go upstairs now that it's not blocked. I wonder if there's anything up there we can get. Mardi Gras sure is tough on the swingers. I find that hard to believe that Mardi Gras would be tough on swingers. She's gone. I guess I really made her mad this time. Apparently, well... We can... Probably make things worse. Or look something takeable. Well, maybe she won't miss this old thing. Comfy. We can, is there anything in the chest? It's just a porcelain replica of the chest. I hate that knick-knacky junk. <laughs> Indeed. We could steal her coat. Nothing back here. Man, she has shoulder pads and everything. <laughs> okay. You know, I heard some guys talking about Marley's bust. This must be it. Of course it is. All right. So nothing up here except for that ore. So we're going to have to see where the hell do you find a fish? I'll drink to that. We can go around the. Fork as loud as you want. Silbert's out raking the back forty. <laughs> that worked. I guess it didn't like that we took the ore. Now we can. We can look at the boxes. Yeah, no thanks. It reeks of fish. Well, that's good. That's what we want. No thanks. They reek of fish. It's a beat up metal trash can. Oh, hang on. Hey, what is all the racket? Don't mess with the governor's cans! Who do you think you are? Huh. Hang on. Can we push it over? You again? You better just get out of here. Is he chasing me? Punk. Is he chasing me? It's not raccoons, it's teenage vandals. Is he, he's not chasing me. Okay. You can go around the other side of the house, though. I kind of get the feeling. Let's just open the door. Oh, that's what we want. We want to steal a fish. Hey, kitchen staff only. Sorry. And we got to distract him somehow. No way. It probably smells. Just knock it over, goddammit. You again? You heard me. Get lost. Transient hooligan. Why I offer Is he chasing me? Is he act He is the actor that chasing me this time? Come back here! I'm not done yet. I have actually pissed him off this time. Alright. I don't have time for this. Go away, boy. You bother me. Yes, well, almost as much as you bother me. All right, so we have successfully distracted him. And we've locked him out. So we should steal a fish. And we've unlocked some concept art. I don't think I need any more. Oh, well, that's, that's, that's your loss. No, nothing else? Well, we can just sneak out the back door. Or, I guess. Oh, there you are. Uh-oh. Anyway, Beat it! <laughs> okay. I'm going to use this meat cleaver in a second. We've made the French chef very mad. If we just run away from him. Let this be a lesson to you. Don't mess with the mad chef. There's a... Oh, there. That's the way out. I think. Yeah, yeah. All right. Back to Dread Chef. We're going to put this up against the best... Fish that her friend back on Fat Island, that's what it was. I was gonna say the Where do you want to go? The island that isn't this, the island is that isn't the one we started on. So we wanna go back to Fat Island and have a chat with our fisherman friend. Why? Because we need that fishing rod of his. If we can get to him anytime now, Mr. Guybrush. Alright. 
you caught anything yet? Yeah, but nothing gross enough to make you eat yet. <laughs> All right, well. Caught anything yet? Okay. Yeah. Okay, that, I'm just going to talk over this because apparently there's no option to just give him the fish. So we shall present our fish. Sure is big. And hopefully big enough, though. Wow. This is the biggest... The, uh, well, it... It's almost as big as the Leviathan I just hauled in. Really? Where is this Leviathan? Uh, uh, I think you're lying. Yeah, you're right. It was just a fish story. I guess you win. Here, take the pole. So, like we were saying, not a blowfish, but a blowhard. As our friend the fisherman is. All right, back to Booty Island, where they make sure you ain't booty. We're gonna snag ourselves the second of four map pieces. And then we just gotta find the last two map pieces, because we got the one that this guy had. We had the one that Governor Marley will have, and then it's just. One that would be on Fat Island, one that would be on Scab Island, right? So that's what we're looking for next. So we want to use... Oh, no. Use the fishing pole with the map. It whips out his pole. And onwards and offwards we are halfway home. To finding... The, with the, oh god, no, 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 god. That sounds like a very, very loose approximation of the Price is Right loser horns. Dang. Yeah, I agree. Took it to the damn tree. All right, fine. We haven't been to the tree yet, so. It was only a matter of time before we had to go there. All right, fine. We've got a plank. Looks like a plank stuck in a hole in a tree. That's a, that's a handy description. Oh, there's an outhouse. We can go into the outhouse. I don't know why we'd want to go in the outhouse because outhouses are. How <clears throat> rustic! Indeed. My aunt, uh, my aunt and uncle had a. Uh, a small camp they call it up in the north. They call them cottages down south. It a, a camp. It was like a it was like a two room, two room small little place. But anyway, they didn't even have indoor. They well, they had indoor plumbing to an extent. They didn't have an indoor toilet though. They had to go to the outhouse, so they never seldom used it in winter. It's kind of like this. It was a composting toilet though. It wasn't an outhouse. They were always keen to clarify that. Can we can we use it? We go on the plank. Big woodpeckers. Indeed. Uh, uh, oh, we have that ore. We can shove the ore into the hole. And on. Oh no! Throw that up on our wasted gifs. Ouch! That really hurts. Ooh, wait a minute. Something very strange is going on here. Do not attempt to adjust your set. Dad? Mom? What are you two doing here? We came looking for you. Where have you been? You came looking for me? But I thought you abandoned me. Why would we do that? We are such loving parents. Yes, we are. So what do you two want? We have some information for you, son. Really? Great! What is it? Well, we're going to give it to you in the form of a song. Oh, okay. What? What the hell? I was going to say, of course, it's like I have to have a musical interlude because. And we're not by Disney at this point, were they? No, not even close. What sort of info am I getting from this? I mean, apart from a, 
a snazzy song and dance routine. This has got to be the strangest, the most bizarrely assembled. Most bizarrely assembled human ever. I gotta write this down. How does this look at old view? Uh-oh. What is it? What's wrong? Why did you leave me again? Boo! <laughs> well, Chuck, but I killed you! You didn't kill me, you little moron! I was already a ghost when you met me! You just destroyed my spiritual essence. A favor that I will now return. Wow, what a dream. I thought the game froze there for a second. Okay, no, we're good, we're good. All right, except we've got a broken oar. Gee, I guess it was an antique. Apparently, all right, let's grab it. Can we put it into, oh. Move out of the way, Gorbush. Oh, we can only give. Fortunately, I already have an idea of what I want to do with a broken oar if we can't do anything with it. I know someone who can fix it. Unless we have to fix it ourselves, in which case I have no idea what to do. But in case we need to... Uh, Where do you want to go? In case we can get someone to do it for us, we can go back here. Friendly neighborhood woodsmith, who I don't think we've pissed off yet. Hi, brother. <clears throat> yeah? Largo the Grand will never bother you again. Yeah. I heard Marty stuck a bunch of pins in his underwear or something. Drove him right out of town. No, it was me. You? What were you doing with Largo's underwear? Um, well, no, never mind. I'd like to look around a bit. Sure thing. All right, so we want to try giving him the broken oil. Excuse me, could you take a look at this? Mmm, looks like a massive fracture. If you're gonna be using this, I better reinforce it for you. Here you go, boy. Steel shank, alloy splints, better than new. Oh, wow, you did it for free? He just taped the thing onto it. Hang on. He, he just, yeah, he just taped it, taped it back together. Well, I guess, I guess that's what we get for free, right? It looks better, stronger, faster. We still have 357 pieces of eight in case we need to pay him to do that, but... Hey, all right. No, that's that's good. We've, uh... We might actually get out of here with two pieces of the map. So we gotta get back on Captain Dredd's ship and set sail back for... Where do you want to go? Booty Island. I wish it would just let you off right onto the world map, but I guess eh, it is what it is. Do the big tree and then do the planky thing. I'm guessing it's just grab a plank and move it from one to the next and one to the next and one to the next. So, so we want to use our reinforced ore with the ore. Get on the plank. And then onto this one. And then uh, use this plank. Already in use. No, no. Go on to here. It's already in use. I guess we gotta pick it up. And use it. With the all. And then... 
grab it and do the same. Just keep doing that. Hmm, I think I get the idea. Oh, I was going to say, keep doing that until you go insane. But no, until the game figures out what you want to do and does it for you. All right, in here. What have we got? Oh, God. That's the bird that stole my map. It's hundreds and hundreds of maps. I don't want them all, and I can't tell which one is Governor Marley's. Uh, no way. He looks like he bites. Uh, no way. Okay. He looks like he bites. How? Do you discern one map from the next? I know. Wasn't that a thing? That they had mentioned. That Guybrush the dog would could sniff out Governor Marley's possessions. I wonder if we could find a way to procure ourselves Guybrush the dog. So I need to. Hi, I need you to come with me, Guybrush. Okay, dog. You're coming with me. <laughs> Well, that's one way of doing it. A long... I'll... I was going to say a long sea, but that didn't come out right. So we can go back to the big tree. And finally bloody well acquire the second piece of the damaged map. If I've done this right. So how hard is it to get him to climb up on that thing? Oh, now he's going to do it himself. All right. Now. We need to use our friendly neighborhood dog with the pile. It's crazy, but it just might work. That worked. Little guy brush. Good boy. Run along home now. Now that's a good dog. Yeah, now I got two map sections. Huzzah! Two down and... However many to go. How, how many... What ones do I have left? Uh, not great shipwrecks. We need... Fame, prize, group, joy, hex. Oh, big whoop. That's what we were looking for. Big whoop. Unclaimed bonanza or myth. It says here there were four pirates. Rap Scallion, the cook. Young Lindy, the cabin boy. Mr. Rogers, the first mate, and Captain Marley. They buried their treasure along with plenty of booby traps on a place believed to be called Inky Island. They made a map which they divided into four pieces, each man taking one. Raph Scallion later opened the Steam and Weenie Hut on Scab Island. It was a huge success, but fell into disrepair after Raph was killed in a flash fire. Young Lindy drifted aimlessly, down on his luck until he mysteriously came into money while panhandling on Booty Island. He used the cash to bankroll an advertising firm which failed after its gross mishandling of the gangrene and honey account. Mr. Rogers retired off the coast of Fat Island. He marketed homemade contest grog brewed in a bathtub until his recent disappearance. Captain Marley vanished while sailing in the America's Cup race. His boat was leaning at the time. So we got the... We got the Booty Island map, and we got the Marley map. So now we need to get the Fat Island map and the... Other map, the... Fat Island and the Scab Island maps. The Scab Island map was tied to the... Well, the, uh, the Weenie Hut that was there. So if you can get into the Weenie Hut. But that is... Actually, if it's that easy, we'll, we'll see what the challenge is this time, and then we'll... If it's hard, we'll just cut the episode short. Where do you want to go? Let us go back to... Scab Island. Once again. Still not happy. Nah, LeChuck, sir. I just wanted to report that we have finished building the new torture chamber you requested. Very good. Do you have anything else to report? Ah, uh, no. <laughs> well, there is one other small little thing. I assume this has to do with Guybrush's capture? Or lack thereof. Uh, sort of. You've allowed him to find the second map piece, haven't you? 
You fool! You ought to ready your ship and sail after him yourself. Find him, or die. Well, this isn't going well for us, or it won't go well for us. Actually, I think that's a good place for us to end off this episode of Monkey Island 2, The Chuck's Revenge. Next time out, we find map piece number three here on Scab Island. Where is it on Scab Island? Actually, I know where it I have an idea of oh, where it is on Scab Island. Here on the beach with the weenie hut right there. But that we find out next time on Monkey Island 2, The Chuck's Revenge. So until then, I'm on silent. Thanks very much for joining me. Like the video if you liked it. Subscribe if you're new. Share on social media. Follow on social media. The social media handle is unsilent on air. And that is for Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, and Tumblr. Don't forget you can check out more Monkey Island 2 in the playlist. It's on the screen in the description down below. And more videos anytime on the channel page. And until the next time, I'm on silent. Thanks very much for joining me. Like, share subscribe and we will see you next time